All right, you guys, so it's snowing a little bit more now. This is actually at the, this is after the video I'm that I forgot to upload. So I just wanted to put this at the beginning, but this is about as heavy as it's gotten. In 700 so, feet, take a slight right yeah. turn onto Big Bear Boulevard. Unfortunately, it's not much. So anyway, love you guys, peace out. New video coming up right now. At the stop. What's up everybody? March 29th, 2020 in the Big Bear Lake, California area. We're actually getting a little bit of snow right now. Um, it's uh it says 38 degrees but it's not 38 degrees it's a little bit cooler than that and it's 6 17 p.m we're gonna go over by bear mountain and then drive up uh, to upper moon ridge just to well unless it looks like that where you can tell there's there are no clouds and there's no snow up there but we're gonna drive over here towards uh bear mountain just to try to catch a little more snow and uh we got our buddy with us right here What's up, guys? How's it going? You guys remember him? Long time no see. <laughs> back. <laughs> right on, right on, right on. Hey, right on, right on, right on. Yeah, so it's good to have Nick cruising with us again. One of the coolest people in the world. Oh, thanks, buddy. Yeah, no problem, man. No problem. So the further we go this direction, the more snow we're going to run into. And, uh, yeah. This is kind of just a back route because there are lots of, uh, cause I'm not like doing a direct drive, like, to, like going to like the store or something. And, uh, I just don't want to get, you know, pulled over, even though I'm not going around people. It's just, it's just Nick and I, like, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm in the car. I'm not stopping anywhere. I'm, I'm, I'm not, you know, putting people in jeopardy or anything like that. So, and the weather is pretty essential. Yeah. Well, yeah. And like, this is, this is what I do. And unfortunately, once again, I have to apologize to you guys that I'm recording snow again. And like, it, it's, you guys can't, can't really come up here because, uh, I mean, yeah, that's just what our town's doing. So at least you guys can kind of see what's going on through here. Um, as I said, I wish you guys could come up here. We need you guys to come up here. You know, you guys are what allow us to stay up here. Your finances, the money that you guys infuse into our economy is what allows us to live up here and, uh, and just, I mean, live the dream. For me, a little mountain town like this is living the dream. Um, so I thank you guys a whole ton for that. And I wish you guys could be up here having fun. But soon enough, soon enough, Okay, so we're gonna go right here and go towards Bear. Um, and it's gonna start snowing even more. Oh, look, you can see it's snowing, it's snowing pretty good right at Bear. So that's cool. Get some good snow there. So we will go up into Upper Moon Ridge that way, right next to Bear on Lassen. And we will certainly be hitting some snow. You know what? I wonder if the gates on, no, the gates on 2N10 wouldn't be open yet, no, would they? they're gonna be closed too. Okay. Although when they close the mountain, they might have opened the gate. You know what I mean? When they close them out because of the virus. I don't know if they would have opened that gate to allow people to go through. Show me check. That's up to you. Because that would be fun. I like both drives. Two and, yeah, yeah. Two and ten's great too. Well, I mean too, two and ten's insanely awesome. But yeah, we'll just do upper moon, moon flidge right now. As you guys can see, we are getting more snow. And, uh, yeah. Bear is getting it pretty good up top. Joe can see it. Oh, it's very good, my friend. <laughs> okay, let me, uh. There's a car right on my ice. Okay, so. As you guys know, that's Bear. Have a nice view of unfortunately bear being closed, which sucks. But we're gonna go up to uh, basically go on the slopes real quick. Well, not on the slopes, but we're just gonna drive up to where the uh, where a lot of the employees park, who deal with like the the grooming up there near the upper parts of bear. So we're gonna do that. Go park right there. Just get a quick view of a silent ski resort 
with plenty of snow for people to go skiing and snowboarding. If you hike up, you can, you know, do it yourself. I mean, not a big deal. Or just take this road and just have your friends keep on dropping you off up here and just take the bunny route. I mean, dude, that would actually be kind of fun. But yeah, look at that, guys. Plenty of snow. But no one to go. Like when there's a lot, when there's plenty of snow and the resort should be just, just bumping. And you can tell there's plenty of snow because they haven't made snow in forever, <laughs> you know, and they're usually making snow every night when they can. So this is what I was talking about. And you guys know this spot that we, uh, we, 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 we go to, you know, frequently. It's just a cool little area. Maybe we could use one of these restrooms. I don't know. But I'm just gonna get out for a second and check out this view. Would you like to get out for a quick sec? Yeah. Okay. This guy just went for a 42 mile hike. Ah, no big deal. <laughs> Seriously, this guy Nick's crazy, you guys. Like, uh, but if if any of you want to go on amazing hikes up here, um, I'm trying to really get him to open up some sort of like a hiking touring company type thing because uh i guarantee you he will take you more places than uh than pretty i think that anybody else could could really take you and uh um he knows what he's doing um the dude's just freaking freaking awesome and uh i think you guys would really really get a kick out of it because it's a beautiful beautiful places that he takes you to i mean he makes some amazing videos of places i've never seen up here never knew existed um, and yeah, like, I just want to help him show you guys the real big bear and the real, real beauty. Um, you know what? Let's go sit in the, in the, in the chair. No. Got this. <laughs> you think we'd get in trouble? Oh, you did? Yeah. Oh, well, I didn't see the no trespassing signs. Oh man. Are you gonna do the sugar roll? Yes. Oh, guys, we're gonna do moon loaf. So let's hit up the moon loaf. It's chilly out here. It is chilly out here, and it's yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, poop and poop too. Look at that one. That one's fun. Okay. All right. All right, All right guys. So we're leaving Bear. Poor Bear. It's starting to snow pretty good. Let me zoom in so you can like kind of really see. Snow. Oh, snow. <laughs> yes, I have problems. 99 problems in. Yep. Yeah, it's really snowing. I mean, not really snowing, but it, you know, we're, we're getting some some heavy flurries. <laughs> All right. Are you drive. Okay. Okay. That one right there. Oh, the one that says uh, no public parking. It doesn't say no yeah, trespassing. Oh. There's one up there. Okay. I can't, my, I can't even see what that says from here, but it, it's clearly telling says, you that like you can't park. Oh, you can't park here. responsible for any damage to any vehicle. Oh, hey, there's a rock star in this guy's car. <laughs> <laughs> and we're getting sleep. What's up? What's up, sleep? See? What's up, sleep? <laughs> I need myself a sleep. I used to drive one of those at work. You drive those at work? Yeah. Really? Yeah. What's it called? The one at work is called a JLG. Same thing. Are they a lot easier to drive than it looks? Not too bad. Not too bad? You think I could drive it? 
Don't be a smart ass. I'm sure you can drive it pretty easily. <laughs> <laughs> it's got four gears. Oh, okay. Because four is, four is my limit. Yeah. Yeah. I, I don't go any higher than four gears, so that's... That's because you can't count higher than four. Well, that's... that's uh, Okay, Conor McGregor. I'm not Nate Diaz, bro. <laughs> you can't count to five. <laughs> Come on, Nate. <laughs> you, <laughs> that interview was was so funny. <laughs> that was great, man. Uh, man. You guys, this this guy right here, I swear, he could be, because he's really good, man. He could be a freaking champion MMA fighter, champion boxer. Um, I, I, like, dude, like, it's it's just it's just crazy the freaking talent. It's unbelievable, like, um, and just uh, um, speed that's just freaking off the rails. Like, like you like feel gusts of wind from like across the room just just from the speed. The guy's amazing, and uh, also besides the hiking and stuff, guys, if you guys want really good you know, private MMA training or better yet boxing and stuff too. Like, uh, I mean, he's, he's a credentialed dude and his resume is pretty, pretty thick. Um, and I vouch for him a million percent. So, uh, yeah, you know, there's a lot more you guys can do up here and yeah, look at, look at the half pipe. That is so sad guys, man. That is so sad. It's all good. It's all good. It got to happen. All right. I'm looking over my dead dog brother. Watch, there's gonna be cops up here. <laughs> <coughs> Maybe the big thick metal gate was was hacksawed by Jim Duggan. <laughs> so guys, as you guys remember, and a lot of you have taken my advice when we do get snow, this is a great place to come. Can you hold? Oh wait, no. Is that might be a. Uh, all right, so it is closed. We were gonna potentially take a risk. No, no, we're good. Thank you. That's just a young man building a snowman with his with his gal with his gal and toe and his girlfriend <laughs> all right um so what the hell i'm doing here we just want to check this out and now we're going to do moon loaf and then head back but i wanted just you guys just to see like uh oh it's so nice you guys Guarantee there's there's going to be a chance not for much longer, but to see like a like a a snowbow, not a rainbow, a snowbow. This is pretty cool. All right. If you get too cold, just let me know, dude. I like driving with the window down. Someone give me crap about how filthy the car is. Like, dude, it's disgusting. I'm like, well, I mean, geez, man. <laughs> I'm gonna clean, it's, it's gonna get clean. It's just not that, it's not that, you know. It's not that pressing of a matter for you. Not at the moment. Not at the moment. Bear Mountain. Oh man, so sad. So sad. So big. Cool neighborhood. All right, so you guys ready to do moon loaf, huh? Ready to do moon loaf? It's gonna be fun. Um, I know we kind of took a long detour. Oh, seriously. And I, believe it or not, guys, I really do miss working there. That was a fun job. That was a fun job. Sorry for sticking the phone in your face like that, buddy. <laughs> you used to have an object stuck in your face like this. <laughs> <laughs> We gotta be appropriate. Alpine Zoo. <laughs> uh, okay. Um. Oh wait. 
Oh wait, I gotta remember how to get. Oh yeah, that's right. We're gonna go up sheep's sheepskin. Sheep uh, sh huh? Sheephorn. Sheephorn. Yes. Good job, buddy. Good job. Here's the zoo, guys. Seriously, such a cool little zoo. I had an annual pass that our good friend Gabriel sent to us. Gabriel Magana. What's up, Gabriel? Tell. Tell Nora I say hello. Tell the kids I said hello. I really hope everything's going okay. Wow, that is beautiful. Man. Well, we're going to be hitting it up like Upper Moon Ridge at like sunset. It's going to yeah, be nice. It's going to be beautiful. It's going to yeah. be so romantic. <laughs> <laughs> oh, stop it. Here we go. And, yep. Really nice views of Bear Mountain right there, Geronimo, the run, the run Geronimo right there, but <clears throat> yeah, you guys, once again, this has been kind of a lackluster uh, winter here. We started off great, I'm going to let this car pass, because he's coming up on my ace, like a champ, like a champ, hey, like a champ, hey, it's a nice Range Rover though, holy smokes, dude, dude, that thing is pimping. Nick want one. I want one. I want one, everybody. Man, I've never seen gas prices so cheap up here either. What'd you see them at? Like three eleven? I saw a two ninety nine. Shut up, dude. Yeah. Where? Seven eleven? Uh, where was I coming from? Uh, no, the one right down the stern. Really? After work. Yep. Nice. That's insane. That's crazy. And people in other states are still laughing. Like, dude, that's like, that's so expensive. <laughs> you guys are paying $2 more than us. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> Bastards. Guys, this area is a great place for you guys to come sledding with your kids when we have snow because they can they can have a lot of fun, slide down, getting going fast, and then not have to worry about get flying right into the street right afterwards. So either side, you slide right up and down. And uh, it's just a great, great little gully. As I said, safe, safety comes first. Um, we want you guys to, you know, keep coming up here, <laughs> you know? So, yes, yes, all right. Rastafari. You damn sure know. You hungry? I'm okay right now. You mind if uh, when we're done with the video that I go through a drive through or something? Well, then I'll probably eat too. Okay. Well, that sounds good to me then. Done food presented he eats. It's one of those times you have to Especially when hot dogs are presented. <laughs> <laughs> this guy's jelly chestnut. <laughs> With a bit of Kobayashi. <laughs> This house is uh, this house right here. I've always liked it. It it, it, it kind of reminds me of like the the Beetlejuice house in a weird way. I I I, I don't know. Just uh, I don't know. I I like it. It's amazing when you look at all these houses. Like pretty much every single one is a uh, is a rental. Three of three out of four of them. It's got like you know maximum occupancy. How many vehicles they uh, they allow in the driveway? This and that. Wow, love that. That's awesome. Man. This is terrific, man. I like, I mean, there's no cars, no one anywhere. We drive all over Big Bear, nothing. Nobody. Do I need, oh, I forgot. Do I need to make left and move? No. No, we go straight. Wait, wait, wait. No, no, we go straight. Now look at this house. It's freaking awesome it's like the gingerbread man isn't that cool though? that is cool I like it. I've never seen that I've driven past it probably a bunch I've never seen it well now you have <laughs> oh this house looks scary looks very nice but scary looks like uh... dude I was just thinking uh, freaking Freddy so I guess those two are not the same well, I don't know I was thinking something along those lines yeah, well, yeah. 
But the one that scared me the most as a kid was Freddy. Me too. It caused me not to sleep. Me too, man. <laughs> me too. As an adult, I don't sleep with my feet untucked from the blanket. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not laughing at that you. That guy's not getting me, bro. <laughs> man, seriously, when I go into haunted houses, the hut's closed. No, oh, dude, we're, we're freaking golden, bro. We're freaking golden. Now we go up here to uh, a street called uh, um, Klamath, and then we're golden. So haunted houses still get you? No, I'm okay with haunted houses, uh, but what if I see Freddy? I'm out. I run. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Freddy has that type of impact on me. I had to like start to like remind myself that his real name is Robert England and it's just an actor and he's a really good actor and he's like he's probably really nice <laughs> like dude <laughs> seriously man <laughs> but I'm I, I'm telling you all most of these horror movies if you just uh if you just you know mute it it's like not well, the thing it's not that gets that. me about most horror movies is there's always a bathroom scene so at night time, I have a problem taking a piss for like the next month. <laughs> Especially right around midnight. Like, yeah. like Bloody Mary. Bloody Mary. <laughs> no, no. I see like still, I'm, I'm like, dude, I still freak out if it's like midnight. And then I look in the mirror saying, just do it. dude. You, I'll, I, I still can't. I won't say anything. I still can't go all the way through it. Yeah. One time's too many. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness my friend so yeah sorry about the camera being so wobbly Juno 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 oh look at that it looked very nice the way it's snowing up there I like that it is very beautiful when this when we get some good snows up here, this area right here is absolutely gorgeous. Just absolutely gorgeous. It just feels like for a moment you're in like a much different mountain range type of an area. It just like, uh, uh, I don't know, it just seems much bigger. But anyway, we're about to hit, oh. Uh, someone texting me, I don't know who that was. So we'll see it in a moment. Okay. So we are on, uh, what's this road called, Nick? Uh, Moon Loaf. That's right. <clears throat> Moon Loaf. He gets a silver star. I don't like pop quizzes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, then that's the end of them. <laughs> All right, guys. Oh. This road is not as fun without snow. Yeah, it's not nearly as fun without snow because we can't fly through it. There are lots of spots to bottom out. But you know what? Let's just. Uh, there we go. Oop, 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 oop. Ay. Oy vey. You know, I wonder if Cocina de Mexico is open. No, no, no probably not. Oh, oh it's they're Sunday. Back. They're closed. That's Sorry. right. Are they closed on Sundays? Yep, they do close on Sundays. Because I've gone up there around two, and they've always been closed. That's one of my favorite places to eat in town. No, the, they're 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 typically open till like uh, till like eight, bro. No joke. But Sundays are closed. So you 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 must have caught them on like like a big party type of a thing or like something. What was a Sunday? Oh, well, that's what I'm saying. Oh, if they're around two, and it was closed. Oh. So. It was closed on a Sunday. Well, that's because they are closed on Sundays. <laughs> um, damn, because that sounds so good right now. It does. Man. Once again, mentioning things we can't have. I know, bro. I'm talking about in and out earlier. Oh, no. I'm so, Dude, guys, I've, I've really been a total jerk. I've been mentioning like in and out and I just did it again and uh, meant like food that we can't have. And it's just, uh, it's, it's quite a bummer. Oh, look at this guy. 
so yeah guys it, it's getting like really cool um how you okay you'll see the main road there's just there's just no one i, I you know i mean well actually today there was more people than i anticipated but it's still just something incredible you guys like uh certainly a once in a lifetime event what's going on right now and uh yeah and and this is a very this so, yeah sorry. no what's up it's a woodpecker tree interesting i don't hear him pecking no look at the holes look at the millions of holes in the tree uh, let's see guys this is a woodpecker tree hold on a sec where oh yeah how old all the way out oh, yeah. there's a lot oh yeah Oh, yeah. That's cool, man. Yeah, thanks for pointing that out. They freaking poked the heck out of that tree, didn't they? Those little peckers. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> this is very, very, uh, very dis not 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 good. Uneven. Very not even. <laughs> Huh? How many AAA calls you got left? I've got about four. Good. Oh no! They just re-upped in December. So I've got eight. Eight. No, seven. Seven. <laughs> oh, he comes back to the school now. Havo. Havo. Yavo, her call. Oh. Um. Okay. Uh-oh. <laughs> uh, dude, like, I tell people all the time what time I close. And I, it's like I tell the same people every time. Huh? Yeah, exactly. Guys, when there's a lot of snow on here, a lot of times this will push you over to the edge, so just be careful. But it's really fun. <laughs> That's a little more sketchy when there's just no snow like this. And uh, these are just the tracks that have just been dug out for people going in and out of the snow. Oh my gosh. Almost there. Almost there. Oh, this is terrific. All right, cool. That was Moonloaf. We did it with no snow. And that tire sound sounds like a flat tire, but it's not. It keeps on making the fun, 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 fun. every time it turns. I go great. Not again. Yeah, yeah, too. <laughs> You're like, oh no, that's just snow. <laughs> 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 Like the biggest blowout I've ever had. The thing was like, like folded <laughs> up. <laughs> it <was> so flat. <laughs> yeah, dude, that was a long day, wasn't it? That was Jeez, man, that was a long day. All right, so hang on a second. I gotta stop this for a moment because I gotta respond to the. All right, message. sorry about that. I forgot to turn the video back on, but it was only a minute, two minutes. Anyway, so we're heading out of Sugarloaf. Um, that little bit of snow that was was coming down. It's uh. It ceases to exist at the moment in our location. However, um, yeah, it's just a, as you guys know, that's what I do. Anytime my weather changes, um, I just, uh, I love to document it. It's, it's kind of an obsessive compulsive disorder type thing, like self-diagnosed, but, uh, that's, it's, it's, uh, it's, it's kind of what it is. Um, but then again, it's very therapeutic for me makes me makes me happy and uh and funny enough it makes a lot of you happy too so that stokes me out <clears throat> that makes me very happy and that's the best part about it so thank you guys for everything and uh yeah so wow look at those big clouds over the desert those look like maybe those are a uh, cumulonimbus Oh, 
was that? No. I thought it was. It's probably like. I don't know. So the town's being surrounded by clouds. Home of the bears. The bears. Oh, we might hit a little bit of snow coming down the hill. Let's see here. I, I, I hope we at least get one more good snow this uh, this season, and then just knock it off until <laughs> until like November again, so we can start doing a lot of motorcycle riding. And I'd like to like either rent or buy like a, like a, um, an enduro or two. Yeah. So we can cruise uh, cruise the mountain off roads and get you guys really good. Well, I mean, you know, Nick will do that for you guys hiking, which you'd get actually a much better perspective like that because it's you're not going as fast. Well. <laughs> 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 this guy's like a motor. <laughs> Seriously. See him just like smiling, hiking three, like three, five miles, like straight up freaking hill and three feet of snow. Just, uh, yeah, not even taking any breaths. It's just amazing. So, lots of fun, you guys. Lots of fun. And as you guys can see, we are going to be driving into some snow. And that is over by our side of town. But yeah, just take a look at how quiet town is. Hardly any cars. I'm glad. I'm glad people are staying safe. We're being very vigilant. We're not going out and hanging out places. And, you know. some pure rail <sighs> what did you say about my lotion problem yes 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 here this guy's that's not cool <laughs> that ain't cool bro I'll tell you what, though, I am really hungry right now. Jam! Hey, seeing you everywhere now. What's up, sexy? I, I, that's what, you're, you're working it right now. Ow! Love you too. Nice to see you. Bye. <laughs> that is Jam. You guys, Janet, Denny's manager. And one fine, fine piece of man. I'm just kidding. <laughs> oh, dude, uh, <laughs> I'm so, oh my god. Dude, seriously, I'm just kidding. I, oh my god. Like, that was a joke. That was a joke. <laughs> oh my god. Um, frontal. Okay, so. Hang on a sec, guys. Alright, people. Another ladies, people. Alright, we are, uh. We're going to McDonald's. <laughs> the line's probably gonna be like 275,000 cars long. If it's that long, um. Sushi, grocery store. Sushi. sushi sounds good too, huh? I could do me some sushi for sure. Get a few of them. Get a couple of them, man. Right? So yeah, guys. Uh, let's see. I know I'm making an extra long video, but I really don't know how, how many more of these little snow events we're gonna get this year. Um, so and this helps you guys see the town. And it helps you guys see. Thank you. Check is in the mail. <laughs> <laughs>
It's Butters! <laughs> That's me! It is snowing over by the damn dam. By the John Claude Van Dam. <laughs> it definitely is. Guys, once again, he is correct. Once again, he is correct. And I'll bet at McDonald's we'll be getting a couple snowflakes coming down. Not many, but a couple. Or maybe not, I don't know. But maybe we'll see. There was one. You see two more. Did you see one? You saw one, my friend? <laughs> Guys, this is so pretty out here, man. Just the blue and the gray and the and the snow coming from. As I said, like we just missed like snowbow opportunities, which are pretty cool because they aren't that common. Even though it, you know, like it's we get snow this time of year, it's just not as common. So it's kind of cool to see a snowbow. And I haven't eaten here in a long time since I worked there three or four years ago. Four years ago. I need to eat there again sometime. Alright, is that another snowflake? I think we're coming in on some snowflakes, my friend. Everybody, I mean, look, there's nothing, you know, buddy, anywhere. They stay home. They don't go out for nothing. I need to seek help. <laughs> Everybody know this. Everybody know this. I'm from Dagestan. My name is Khabib. Don't make a kick your ass off. I wish I was the Khabib. Just, just, no, just to dominate people. Like, you wish you were Khabib. Just dominating people. I mean, dominating champions like they're nothing. Just throwing them around. That's stuff you could be doing if you weren't a freaking, like, kick-ass industrial electrician, bro. You could be doing that. I'd love to be going to fights and, and watching you just smash people. Well, if gyms were open, I would be able to train. <laughs> <laughs> well, guys, hey, hey, any of my big MMA guys out there, please... Like, uh, telling you right now. And you know what? You know what? I know Tony Ferguson's looking for a sparring partner right now. Really? Yeah, dude. And I have his freaking email. Yeah, dude. Let's let's check it out. He, yeah. Yeah. He he wants a sparring partner. Let's do it. Um, so he said, send your freaking resume. All right, guys. We're at McDonald's and there's nobody here. This is amazing. But anyway, this is the video. Say goodbye to Nick. Bye, guys. It was good seeing you again. See you guys. Let's take care. And uh, yeah, we'll talk to you later. Peace out.